fool had made it out of the catacombs, but couldn't escape what he'd become. He was thirsty, desperate for a drink. Ah, <sighs> no. Hi, mister. You know where the pirate's at around here? <laughs> <laughs> Coal had drunk her dry. He didn't choose to do it. Instinct had taken over. But her blood was now on his hands. And in his veins. You're one of us now. Embrace your new life. It's wonderful. To fuel such powers, you'll need more blood. Rivers of juicy, warm, human blood. Drink them dry. The blood of lovers is a taste to be savored. That's it. Keep your strength up. My children are going to test you tonight, and I want to see what you can do. I've never had a subject with abilities like yours. Oh, you're such a treasure. Hey man, where you at? Been off the radar for a while. Zeke, I, uh... I got bitten by a vampire. <laughs> really? Do you look more handsome than normal? Do teenage girls suddenly find you irresistible? Hey, I'm serious, Z. I, I tried fighting back against the vampire who bit me, but she gets inside my head and, and, and takes control. Bloody Mary says that come sunrise, I'll be your slave. Oh, okay. Look, brother, we've been through weirder stuff than this. Now, it can't be a coincidence that they showed up on Pirate Night. There's gotta be a connection there. What with all these demon decorations and whatnot. <laughs> Yeah, okay. That's a start. Hey, maybe I'll run into a few vampire groupies while I'm out there. Hey, that's the spirit. bitten by a vampire. <laughs> really? Do you look more handsome than normal? Do teenage girls suddenly find you irresistible? Hey, I'm serious, Z. I, I tried fighting back against the vampire who bit me, but she gets inside my head and, and, and takes control. Bloody Mary says that come sunrise, be your slave. Oh, okay. Look, brother, we've been through weirder stuff than this. A coincidence that they showed up on Pirate Night. There's gotta be a connection there. What with all these demon decorations and whatnot. Yeah, okay. That's a start. Hey, maybe I'll run into a few vampire groupies while I'm out there. Hey, that's the spirit.
Father Ignatius Demon Slayer. Hey Z, I just saw a banner of Father Ignatius smiting demons. What do you think about that guy? I know he's got a badass mustache. I've seen his statue over by the cathedral. Are you thinking he had some kind of technique for dealing with the blood guzzlers? Yeah, I'm just hoping it works without having to get ordained. Vow of chastity and all that. <laughs> ah, abstinence. I sure wouldn't know anything about that. Long nights alone, staring at a bikini magazine. That's foreign territory to me. Okay, good talk.
All right, man, it's really looking like it was Ignatius that torched Mary way back when. But I've got to figure out how he got close. You know what? They got the Legend of Pyre Night show going on by the clock tower. And I'm pretty sure Ignatius is in it. That's kind of like the Nativity at Christmas. Except in this one, it's all about demons and fire. It's for the kids. to be revealed. Come on and let me take you all back in time, friends. Back to the early days of Numeray. The streets of our town were filled with laughter, and the people were full of hope. Till folks started disappearing from the streets at night. Only one man, Father Ignatius, was brave enough to walk in the shadows, hunting for the devil who would harm his flock. And it was from the shadows that he spotted her, a vile woman, feeding on a man's flesh. And as fast as a thought, she was gone, taking refuge in the crypts beneath the city. That very night, Ignatius rallied his fearful parish to action, leading the way down into the crypt. And as they came upon the nest of sinners, he held aloft his holy barred cross, and the sinners scattered like cockroaches from its holy light. But their leader, Bloody Mary, she wasn't fast enough. Ignatius brought her up before his church and tied her to a pile, and as flames licked at her heels, the devil woman revealed her true form while shouting out a curse. Vowing that one day, she'd return and take her revenge. And what happened to Ignatius, you ask? Well, he's still with us, my friends. Buried in St. Charles Cemetery, right alongside his barbed cross. And that's why we burn, my friends. To warn Bloody Mary's ghost and all the other sinners of this world to stay clear of Numeray. You can dance, sing, and walk the streets. Cause nothing, and I mean nothing, is gonna eat you on Pyre Night. <laughs> All right, Z, I need you to look up where Ignatius is buried in St. Charles Cemetery. Turns out, he was in tomb with some sort of vampire-killing relic. No problem. All them goths love to make cemetery maps and then put them online. Man, I'd love to get me a goth girl. All that eye makeup, I'd be like kissing a raccoon. Whew, that's hot.